the plant versus Anthony Durrell. Who wins? Before I get into that, hit the thumbs up, sub, and notification button. That way you get updated when I drop the news content like this. With that being said, let's get into the video. So like always, you know I don't do predictions until the weigh-ins. I like to see how they look on the scales before I do it. Very high percentage. Check the playlist for predictions. You'll see my last live commentary. I predicted every fighter that I thought would win on that fight card. And every fighter that I predicted did win on that fight card. If you want to consider those officials, add that to my numbers. If you don't, then it doesn't matter. I only consider official predictions the ones that I actually do breakdowns on, which I'll do a breakdown for this fight. But I will say, going into this fight, do not be surprised if Darrell can beat Caleb Plant. Do not be surprised. Do not be surprised at all. Caleb Plant has got very low opposition. Darrell, he's fought who's who's. Yes, he's came up short. However, experience is experience and the only real experience that Caleb has is Canelo now unlike Canelo Darrell is taller than Plant unlike Canelo he can touch Plant whenever Plant tries to outbox so there's that got to keep that in mind and Darrell does have a lot of power whereas Caleb doesn't have that much punching power you can't really say youth is involved in this because I believe Caleb is 30 years old. So youth is really not involved in this fight at all. Like he's 30. He's not young. I mean, yeah, nowadays 30 is younger for a boxer, especially at the top level as they're all in their 30s normally. However, he's no Devin Haney. He's no Shakur Stevenson. He's not that young. So again, I don't think age is a factor. It's going to come down to experience. And again, I will do the official prediction when they do the weigh-in. Later on tonight, I will be doing another video on the press conference interview that came on later after this one, which was Wilder versus Hellenius, both them putting their two cents. So I want to touch on that as well. Anyways, let me know what y'all thought about the press conference in the comment section below. And who do you think will win the fight?